told you, idiots, we don't need assassins here. There's nobody on this spin and stink nugget of a planet you couldn't just kill with a heavy rock and a can-do attitude. Athena and the rest of her lady ninjas would be better served on a planet where the air doesn't taste like armpit sweat. Yeah, ignore my last message. The assassins might actually be kind of useful. Athena's girls cleared out the roads around T-Bone Junction, didn't leave one bandit standing. She asked permission to look for somebody named Jess in the villages nearby, uh, which I granted. Seems like a nice enough kid. Which, given what I hear you guys do to the assassins when they're children, is uh, pretty damn impressive. Athena smiled today. That was kind of creepy. She got back from a recon around 0300, said she had a good lead on this Jess chick she'd been looking for. I just kind of grunted at her. She wouldn't stop talking. All excited. Said they were sisters or something. Said she'd been looking for her since she was a kid. Said that they'd escaped Pandora together once she found her. Like I said, uh, nice enough, kid. Don't screw her over or I'll be pissed, you assholes. What the hell did she do to you to deserve that? You order a Code 64 on a village knowing full well her sister who lived there? For hell's sake, she took out her own sister in all the confusion because you ordered thermals only. You had to tie up that one last loose end just to keep her in the core. So that's what happens when you know too much to leave, but you're too good at your job to die. <sighs> when she realized what she'd done, she, uh, she got a little stabby. She's in the brig now. Probably ship her back to Atlas HQ tomorrow. God, I hate this place.